Layoffs could be coming to the Seattle School District. A looming budget deficit is forcing the district to consider making some cuts. The district says it's already notified some staff about the possibility of losing their jobs. King Fives Farah Jadron is live right outside district headquarters with the latest so far. What have you learned? Well, Christine, uh, considering layoffs is something that they are uh, not taking lightly right now uh, in the Seattle Public School District, the overall structural budget deficit, according to the district, is growing to $131 million. And the district says that budget deficit is something that's caused by a number of factors, including gaps in state basic education funding, uh, also declining enrollment. The district says its enrollment's been declining since 2013, all the while its staff numbers have been increasing to meet the needs of students over the years. The state does not fully fund several school positions, including school leaders, school nurses, and social workers. Now, keep in mind, the district is required to pass a balanced budget for the 2023-24 school year. It's scheduled for a vote in early July. As of right now, they have several budget work sessions happening, including one last night. If we look at the end of this journey around budget reconciliation uh, and all the things that we're doing, we're trying to put ourselves in a position where we, at, we ultimately have a, a set of well-resourced schools. Now, Dr. Brent Jones said that while something like consolidating schools is not yet on the table, it's something that could be a part of the future as they figure out their financial future going forward. For right now, they're considering those staff layoffs to work on that budget deficit. Now, that was a work session last night. They are scheduled to have a community budget work session in uh, this month, and that's on March 20th. And the district says that's going to be a great time for folks to get there, uh, ask questions, and to learn more about their strategy plan going forward. Live in Seattle, Farah Jadrin, King 5 News.